Okay, it's FET test time. I've got 12 volts coming out of here, powering the circuit. Here's the circuit itself. Uh, we've got input, the resistors specified in the circuit. There's the FET itself with a massive heatsink. There's a light bulb connected to the output here. And I've got this power supply here controlling the gate voltage. And we've got this meter here which is set up as an ammeter that's measuring the output. So, as you can see, when I set this thing to 1.3 volts at the gate, no current flows, no light bulb on. But when I turn the voltage up here, and we get to the point slowly, we start to see a small amount of current flow, then a bit more. Light bulb still not showing anything. When I get up to about 5 volt, 4.3, there we go, we've got 300 milliamps. The light bulb's just on. If I increase it a bit higher, it's 5 volts. I've got light bulb now fully on, drawing about 400 milliamps, which, because it's a 5 watt bulb, is about right. And if I keep increasing the gate voltage, no matter what happens, that still stays at 400 milliamps. The reason being, because this load won't draw any more current than required. But it is proof that the FET works. And as soon as I drop below again, the light bulb goes off. So below 5 volts, nothing. As soon as I turn this up and it hits 5 volts, there we go. Comes on. Brightness. Okay. So that's how you use an FET to drive a, a small load. I think now connect up and try a motor.